What's up, challengers? Today's video is a good one. Be sure to watch to the end. Don't forget to post your challenges to our site. Link in the description. Be sure to send us any clips you want to include in our next video. League of Legends has released some amazing original content. Ross Boomsocks uses their latest Pentakill album for a creative new challenge. The premise is what we're going to be doing is we're going to be shuffling the Pentakill album and then whatever song happens to come on shuffle, we build that item. There's a whole new album and a whole new bunch of items we're allowed to buy. The item that we're going to be buying is Tear of the Goddess. Let's not question it. Let's just walk to lane, shall we? <laughs> oh no. Why is my tear not stacking? I need more mana. What the heck? <laughs> That's gonna be my adventure for the whole game. I think it's the worst part. I have to just pray that this person is like absolutely terrible. I think that's my only out. I may actually get what I wish for this Christmas. <laughs> okay, Tear of the Goddess has been bought. What are we buying next? Star Razor. <laughs> you gotta be kidding me, dude. Get back here, coward. I hate you. Oh my god, there's a billion of them, huh? Okay, I didn't expect uh, Harry Poggers to come up top. Okay, Star Razor has been picked up. Next item is gonna be Blade of the Rune King. Okay, right. You can't get me in a good position, can you? You little nerd, come here, twerp. <laughs> oh no, not again. My fourth death to Belbeth. Oh my goodness. Okay, we buy coal. Next item. Rapid fire cannon. Hello, Chief. <laughs> oh no, I keep doing it every single time. I thought. Who's that? Ah! <laughs> Good game. Did she still go for it? What the hell? So relax, Spellbeth. Relax, relax. Ross's loss just shows that not all challenges can be so easy. Another leak challenge pushes the game back above PUBG on the leaderboard. If you thought that simply surviving a walk down the street in GTA Online was tough enough, try taking a look at things Sonny Evans gets up to. Can you walk an NPC across the map in a GTA Online public lobby without dying? You know the drill. Full public lobby, no passive mode, no bullshittery. We go from the south side to the north side of the map, and once reached with any walking NPC, it's a victory royale for us. Sounds easy, right? Now, spoiler alert, this literally took three weeks and three recording sessions. There was two issues that we kept facing. One, the GTA Online players are a sweaty, toxic cesspool of degeneracy and fuckery of the highest degree. Two, our NPCs get startled at the most random things and start running into the wrong direction, getting themselves killed. And so I lean back in my chair and turn towards the one person we all turn towards in times of great peril, Dwayne The Rock Johnson. And I thought about the song. It's about drive, it's about power, we stay hungry and we devour, put in the work and put in the hours and take what's ours. And then it hit me, who has the drive? Who always stays hungry? Who puts in the work and literally tries to take what is ours? The mugger. My sweet Jesus Christ in a whirlpool surrounded by rubber duckies, this is the answer. Thank you, Dwayne The Rock Johnson. You pay this guy 800 bucks and he'll get the damn job done no matter what. Now there are some downsides, like he has no situational awareness at all. It is just him and the target, and he will go right after you no matter what is in between, be it ravines, cars, or 60 ton buses. Are you still alive? Are you still alive? You shaking it off? It'd be more, <laughs> he's more better out than ever. <laughs> About 20 minutes of slowly serpentining through the city, avoiding players left and right, morning followed. And ladies and gentlemen, could this be it? 
we decided to join the mugger for this last moment. After sitting in his damn car for so long, why not do this together with him? And thus, we ran onwards. We could hear the airplane jets just coming from the building behind us. We are so damn close. All we need to do is reach the terminals. Get up there. Where is he? Where's the mugger? He's running. He's down here with me. He's going along the other way. But the mugger... The mugger positioned himself as a goalkeeper to our challenge. All I need to do is get past him. The win is right there behind him, and just like that. He's not getting shit. He's not getting any shit from me. Yes! My god, it's finally over. Oh. Quickly, take his coin. No, 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 Quickly. no, 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 no. no. Sonny Evans climbs up the ranks of her player's leaderboard. Fortnite's new reality saplings are a fun way to get a bunch of great loot. Typical gamer just sees a new challenge opportunity. All right, guys, it's time to harvest our mythic plant. We've seen it grow from a little baby plant into a gigantic, enormous one. And now we must pluck the fruit from its branches and win the game just with mythic loot only. We got a mythic fruit. Did you know that depending on where you plant your reality seed, you'll get different mythics? If you plant it in the grassland, you'll get the mythic hammer AR. The desert will give you the mythic stinger. Fountains is the mythic DMR. And finally, if you plant it in the reality bloom, well, let's just see what happens. We got a shotgun. Okay. Honestly, shotgun and six splashes. Mythic two shot shotgun, baby. This shotgun being my only weapon is a little bit down bad, but you love to see mythic weapons, right? I mean, look at this thing. If we find any other mythic, we can use it because it's definitely from a reality plant. What is that noise? Who broke that rock? Okay, you know, this I feels like feel like I'm in a Scooby-Doo mystery right now. Who broke that rock? I know the rock didn't just break itself. Oh, they must have been up there. I think they're probably up here. Yep. They certainly are. Just calm down. Everybody calm down, all right? Oh, you rifted me. Okay, that honestly scared me a little bit. I didn't expect you to rift me. I thought you like shot me for a second. I'm riding a golden mythic griffin. What do you have on me? I have so much heals. It's actually insane. Look how many big pots I have. Really, I just want to get some more mats. That's going to be like the big thing here. Just a little more and I think I'll be all right. Ooh, he's shooting at me. Holy Wow! Honestly, I'm starting to like the two-shot shotgun. I don't know. Oh my gosh, mythic hammer. This is actually perfect. Um, some more of these mushrooms. I got this wall, I kill him. Bro, he's gonna be like full health after this. Oh, what a shot. Oh, mythic weapons are great. They're fantastic. No! It was close, but I didn't have the uh, mats, unfortunately. But I still want to get with mythics anyway. Play the clip. Get another challenge done, TG holds his top spot on the leaderboard. Wacky Jackie 101 doesn't usually go for high kill games, but when he does, all he needs is a DPS shotgun and a lobby full of targets. I was just had to be quiet so I can hear where these guys were. Here, here another guy. YOLO! Oh, another guy. I'm gonna push and attack everything that moves. Everything I can find. Next! <laughs> oh, right. Oh, 
Okay, I see him, I see him. More! More, 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 more! Where, where the heck are you? Oh, I see you. More! Jackie climbs the leaderboard to pass Lachlan and Fuglet and gets PUBG back above League of Legends. Smurfing in a game like Valorant is never fair. Unless you're choosing to only use a classic, of course. Today, my Russian friend and I will be playing in low rank competitive, but we can only use right click classic. The point of these videos is not to stomp on people, rather to be fair as possible. So we've established the following rules and handicaps. We cannot stomp on the enemy team. We cannot bottom frag for our team. We cannot match MVP, although team MVP should be fine if we're losing really badly. Classic burst only and knifing at dire situations. With that said, this is what happened when my best friend Russian Russ and I went classic burst only in low rank competitive. We should pick very carefully. Never mind, you already locked in. You don't buy a ghost, dude. I do buy ghosts. No, you we right click on oh, them. Dude, unbind your classic. unbind your, your actual shoot button. Really? That's what I did. Yo, I can't, I can't, yo, I can't, I can't. Oh shit, dude. Oh my god. Dude, okay, hear me out. I was left clicking to place my wall, but because I unbound my primary, it wasn't placing the wall. <laughs> I was just screaming, I can't. We're gonna take it back, Suka. Easy peasy. Yes. Bro, what the f Left side, left side, yeah. Oh, I die. One short. Last one short. Get him, get him. Jump Oh. Honestly, dude, this is actually scary. Oh, right here. I'm not gonna lie. I think on they're me. A. On me. Wait. I think they're A. Let's go. Ah, oh, they're B. Oh my. Are you right clicking? <laughs> yeah. Oh my god. Oh, okay. Coming A long, A long, A long, A long, A long. Oh, planting C, bro. What are you talking about? What was A long? Spike planted. I don't think they were A long. Hold up. Oh, planting C, bro. What are you talking about? Wait a minute. I don't think they were A long. Something ain't right. You thought, you thought too soon, my what? guy. What? what? Has anyone ever told you your, your mic sounds like it's from Walmart? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Spike down. C, you should run. Oh, no. <laughs> Oh, right here, right here, yes, yes. No, no. Let's go. Oh, no. Ammon climbs further up ranks of the player's leaderboard.